doorbell at Miffy's house rang. Grandpa and Grandma Bunny had come to visit. Hello, Miffy, said Grandma Bunny. We thought we would come and visit you in your house. But as it is such a lovely warm day, we thought we could take you to the beach instead. Oh, how wonderful, shouted Miffy. I would love to show you the beach. What a nice idea, said Mother Bunny. I will pack you a nice lunch so you can have a picnic. And you can tell Miffy what the beach was like when you were young. Father Bunny said, I will drive you to the beach in our car. So off they went in Father Bunny's car. When they arrived, Grandpa Bunny said, When we were young, we used to make castles in the sand. Perhaps we can make some more today. Yes, said Father Bunny. I remember making sand castles too. We can all make some together. I did it too, said Grandma Bunny. I remember that the sand had to be wet. So Miffy picked up her bucket and went down close to the water. She filled the bucket with wet sand and brought it up to where the others were sitting. Miffy had to do it many times because it took a lot of sand to make a proper castle. How beautiful it was! And just as the castle was finished, along came Melanie, Miffy's bunny friend. Would you like to play ball with me, Miffy? asked Melanie. Oh, yes, said Miffy. Don't go too far, said Father Bunny. You might get lost. We won't get lost, Father, said Miffy, because we know that you will be where the sandcastle is. So Miffy and Melanie ran off, kicking the ball along the beach. Soon, they were quite far away. Meanwhile, the water was slowly rising up the beach. Oh dear, said Grandma Bunny. The water is coming very close to our sandcastle. We'd better move back a bit. And sure enough, the water soon came up and washed away the whole castle. Miffy and Melanie were tired and they started to go back. Where is your family, Miffy? asked Melanie. I can't see them. Don't worry, Melanie, Many times, because it took a lot of sand to make a proper castle. Beautiful it was. And just as the castle was finished, along came Melanie, Miffy's bunny friend. Would you like to play ball with me, Miffy? asked Melanie. Oh, yes, said Miffy. Don't go too far, said Father Bunny. You might get lost. We won't get lost, Father, said Miffy because we know that you will be where the sandcastle is. So Miffy and Melanie ran off, kicking the ball along the beach. Soon, they were quite far away. Meanwhile, the water was slowly rising up the beach. Oh dear, said Grandma Bunny. The water is coming very close to our sandcastle. We'd better move back a bit. And sure enough, the water soon came up and washed away the whole castle. Miffy and Melanie were tired and they started to go back. Where is your family, Miffy? asked Melanie. I can't see them. Don't worry, Melanie, said Miffy, 
They are right by our sandcastle. But Miffy looked and looked, and she didn't see the sandcastle. She didn't know that the seawater had washed it away. She and Melanie walked and walked along the beach. Where is that castle? said Miffy. Maybe we really are lost, Melanie. Miffy, Melanie, we're here. The sea came up and washed our castle away. It's nice that our houses are not made of sand, said Miffy. They were all very happy to be together again.